Hello teachers and students. In this video, I am going to walk you through Max number line activities. Using the link given in the description, you can try these activities for free. Mark the below number in the number line. 550. So a number line is given here. We can scroll the number line. We have 500 and 500, 600 here. So the major division is 100 and minor divisions, there are 10 minor divisions and each represents 10. So 550 is present here. 240, let us scroll the number line. So 200 is here and 240 is here. 720, we can find it here. Okay, in the same way, we can do rest of the problems. Let us try one more. Okay, here the major division is 50. And the minor division, there are 10 minor divisions. So, each division is 5. So, 155. So, we have 105, 150 here. And 155 comes here. 245. 245 comes here. 125. 125 comes here. Okay. In the same way, we can do the rest of the problems. Let us try one more here. Here the major division is 100 and minor division. Each minor division is 25. Okay. 275 is present over here. 150 comes here. 725 comes here. Okay, good. Same way, we can do the rest of the problems. Let us try a different type of problem. Here, in the, in the number line, a problem is given. We need to find the problem. So, this one is an addition problem. The starting point is represented by the red dot. So, red dot represents 380. And each minor division represents 10. So, we need to add 10 here and we will get 390. Oops. Yeah, we made a mistake. It is 370 plus 10. Let's move to the next problem. So here the red dot represents 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 760. Let us not make any mistakes this time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90. So we get 850. Yeah, we got it right. So here the red dot represents 1, 2, 3, 4, 640. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 90 plus 90. And we get 730. Yes, in the same way, we can do the other problems. Let us find something here. Okay. So here the major division is 100 and minor division is 25. So here we have 175 plus 75. 75. We get 250. Let's scroll the number line. So the starting point is 650. 650 plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 plus 150 and we get 800. Okay, let us try something else. This one, yes. So here, this is a subtraction problem because the number line moves in the negative direction. So the starting point is 220 minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, minus 60, and we get 160. 
yes the starting point is 380 380 minus 30 minus 30 so we get 350 yes let's try some other problem so here the major division is 1 actually okay so 1 and minor division is 0.1 okay. so this point the starting point here it actually represents 2.7 2 .7. 2 .7. 2 .7. 2 .7. 2 .7. 2.7 1,2,3,4,5,6,7,8 0.8 yeah, we got it right. So the starting point is 4.1. So this problem gives, gives us idea about how to solve the decimal based problems. 4.5. Yes. But this is a subtraction problem. We have 5 minus 0 0.5 and we get 4.5. So this is an addition problem 6.2, 6.2 plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 0 0.5 and we get 6.7. Yes, let us try some other problem. Here, actually, there are two additions 4 plus 2 plus 1, and we get 7. So, 2 plus 4 plus 2, and we get 8. 3 plus 2 plus 4 and we get 9. Let's try something else. So this looks little tricky. So first we have a starting point and we move to the right. So there is an addition is there and again we move to the left. There is a subtraction. The starting point is 2 and we add 4 to it. And then we subtract 4 from it and we get 2. The starting point is 2. We add 1 to it and then we subtract, subtract 2 from it and we get 1. 4, we add 2 to it and we subtract 2 from it, we get 4. Starting point is 1. We add 4 to it and then we subtract 4 from it and we get 1. Great. Uh, please try these activities and thanks for watching this video.